okay hi everyone so today let's uh, discuss this interesting problem so it says of flywheel of movement of inertia 5 kg meter square is rotated at a speed of uh, 60 radian per second because of the friction at the axle it comes to rest in 5 minutes fine okay so what is given moment of inertia is given 5 kg meter square right initial angular velocity is given that is uh, 60 radian per second finally it will come to rest so final omega will be zero after time 5 minutes so time is given 300 seconds okay so we have to find the average torque of the friction what is average torque that is nothing but i into average angular acceleration what is average angular acceleration that is total change in angular velocity omega final minus omega initial divided by total time t so what is omega final zero initial omega 60 divided by time that is 300 so average angular acceleration that will be minus of 1 by 5 now what is average torque that is i5 into alpha average minus 1 by 5 it will be minus 1 newton meter minus kya hai because iska jo direction hoga na wo opposite hoga initial omega ke direction of average torque will be opposite to the direction of initial angular velocity or initial angular velocity ka direction humne positive liya hai isiliye ye negative aa raha hai if you want to find out magnitude you can say average value of the torque is 1 newton meter simple okay option b the total work done by the friction how to find out work done by friction see there are uh, two methods to find out work done by friction either you can use work energy theorem in rotational kinematics it says work done by all the torques is equal to change in rotational kinetic energy of the body delta k now they got torque kiss ka lagega self friction force ka lagega so we can say work done by the torque of the friction force or you can directly say that work done by the friction force is equal to change in kinetic energy rotational kinetic energy of the body that is k final minus k initial or you can say half of i into omega final square minus initial omega square so half of i ka value 5 into omega final 0 minus initial omega 60 square so this will be the value of work done by the torque of friction force second method is uh, very simple that is the basic definition of the work done by a torque that is work done by a torque is equal to torque dot theta so what is total work done average torque into total angle rotated means theta total now average value of the torque we already know that is minus one how to find out uh, total angle rotated by the body before coming to rest theta total kaise nikaloge theta total will be simply omega initial into time plus half of alpha into t square right so initial omega is uh, 60 into time is 300 plus half into alpha average alpha means uh, that will be minus 1 by 5 into t square that will be 300 square so this is the value of theta t so is a put kar dena yaha pe or average torque is minus 1 then you will get the value of total work done by the friction force okay option c the angular momentum of the wheel one minute before it stops rotating one minute before it stops rotating means after four minutes right so we have to find out uh, angular momentum after four minutes uh, what is angular momentum i into omega i ka value humme pata hai kitna five omega kaise nikalenge after uh, four minutes omega final that will be initial omega plus alpha into t initial omega will be 60 alpha will be minus 1 by 5 time will be 4 minutes 4 into 60 that is 240 so here you will get the value of omega final you can put it here to get the value of angular momentum fine i think uh, you have understood let me know if you still have any confusion we can discuss further okay guys keep working hard best of luck bye